the Alentejo is a, a, a land with a, with a strong soul and uh, it really gets to you. But of course, uh, what makes a, a, a region uh, something unique is uh, its people. People in the Alentejo are uh, warm and um, like myself, they are really proud of where they live. We are actually very proud to uh, get together with uh, Cork Yoga uh, because we share the same values. We are all about uh, helping uh, smaller communities. Uh, we are all about mental healthness uh, and uh, sharing the best of us uh, and getting connected to, to the earth, to, to the people. So um, the whole experience is about relaxing and finding the best of the region. When Cork Yoga Project uh, came up, we, we just felt it was the perfect match. They had Cork, they had Yoga, we had the perfect place to do it. The name E Cork Hotel, E stands for Evora Cork, like the Cork trees in the forest where we are, and also Evolution. We have this piece we are five miles from the center town, but in, in the middle of a forest of cork oaks. We cannot imagine Alentejo without cork, cannot imagine ourselves without this uh, landscape. So that's part of our identity. What we really want to promote here too is the, the wellness connected to the nature, bringing you to the heart of the cork forest the first thing you will feel is a deep and absolute contact to the nature. In the core tree you can, you can find a philosophy to your life. Because you're looking at the tree that grows slowly because it needs time to grow. I think mentally it's a very powerful concept that we can retain from this nature that wants us to stop and wants us to wait for the new layer of cork that is coming to our lives. Every time we come to strip a cork tree, it, it grows stronger and the cork comes better. And I think from this point of view, cork forest shows uh, an, an amazing dimension of uh, mindfulness and promotes our health in, in this perspective. With olive oil, we are showing Portugal to the world. We are doing uh, here things differently. This is a, an organic farming production. We have only 231 trees. Our younger trees are 70 years old and the older ones are 2,000 years old. We believe that uh, we should work with what nature can give us each year. And that's why uh, we don't add any kind of chemicals to our olive oil. Our olive oil, it's just the juice uh, from our olives. We are producing an olive oil made with green olives with a much more intense aroma and also with a, a different flavor. And this kind of uh, characteristics you are not going to be able to find uh, any place else. And that's why when people come here there is an experience of uh, being in the nature, sh uh, showing the farm and telling the, the history of the farm, but also we want people to learn how to choose an olive oil. It's, it's really nice because at the end we feel that uh, people go home with a little bit of Portugal culture in their minds. Since the COVID-19 epidemic started, we were one of the first hotels in the first day to implement the new regulations about clean and safe. Actually, because of uh, not many people living here, it is uh, for sure one of the safest regions uh, in Portugal, which is already on the top three world uh, safest destination. This nature is incredibly protected and uh, is totally open as it always was to everybody who wants to visit it without any concerns. There's plenty of space, there's um, plenty of open areas to, to visit and to, to use as perfect spots in every condition. 
and after the end of a visit I have no doubts that everybody comes uh, leaves this place stronger and with full mind uh, about nature sensation and natural uh, present in the spirit. We are looking forward to see you in a safe, natural and wonderful place that is called Alentejo. I am absolutely convinced that if you come to the Alentejo, uh, you will want to come back.